What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33, where I get messages from the divine and I give them straight to you guys. So clearing out all of the energy that will not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel the current energies. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Clear and accurate messages. Welcome all my supporters. I appreciate you guys for liking and commenting and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate all of the love, the support, the donations, the bookings, all of the positivity that you guys been showing me. I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much. I appreciate you guys, man. And all the services that I provide will be down below in the description box, all right? All right, y'all. So I'm going to share a little story with y'all. So listen, y'all know I have my little stories I like to share with y'all, right? So the other day, right, I had got a comment up under one of my videos and it was like a long comment. So I read like maybe a few sentences of this comment. And basically this woman was saying um, that Divine wouldn't give me messages and Divine is a liar. They lied to me and um, Divine is stepping out of line if they give me messages and all this other shit, right? So I was like, the fuck? Who the fuck are you? Like, that's basically how I just got like offended. Like basically saying like, how you gonna say the divine is out of line for giving somebody messages? Like the fuck, who the fuck are you? You know? So I had put my phone down and I went in the kitchen to check on my food, you know? And then I had, you know, came, you know, after I was checking on my food, I came back and looked at my phone again. It was 444. So I was like, okay, Divine is letting me know they heard that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, the fuck? Who the fuck this person think they is, right? Maybe a few minutes later, I had got a phone call. I was trying to, uh, before the phone call, I was trying to listen, not listen. I was trying to, uh, finish the, uh, looking at the message. You know, I was trying to, like, continue reading it. But then I had got a phone call that I had been waiting on, right? for you know for a minute maybe like a week or so and it was great news i got you know real happy and shit you know what i'm saying i was happy about the news that i got and um i was like divine basically was telling me like don't let nobody listen i got you like the fuck like divine didn't even want me to finish reading that dumbass message you know what i'm saying like you know, don't let no motherfucker, like, make you the fuck. I got you. Like, concentrate on the good shit. You know, basically, that's what the Bible was telling me. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, y'all. That was a little story, like, you know. All right, Spirit, what's the message? What is the message? Y'all know I have my little stories I have to tell y'all. I have so many. Man, I have so many. Like, just different shit, yo. Alright, so we have the sun car. Enjoy success and happiness. We have embrace the energy of peace. And we have summer. Uh-oh. Alright, so what I'm getting is, in the summertime, um, somebody is about to have some a lot of success and happiness. Alright? And Divine wants you to know that you have a peace around you, okay? Um, confidence is the key to success. So I could feel like, I feel like somebody could have a lot of confidence and different things like that. Divine say believe in the impossible. Believe in it, okay? Because a new start is coming that's going to blow your fucking mind, I feel. That's how I feel. It's a new start coming that's going to blow you away, all right? Possibly in the summertime, all right? Could have something to do with a Leo, Okay, or um, because of your courage and different things like that, this is why this is happening for you. 
All right. So let's get into it. All right. So basically the message that I've been getting is they are lurking behind the shadows. Okay. I had a dream last night. I sound like Martin Luther King, <laughs> but I did though. I for real had a dream though that, and this person in this dream told me like, be careful. They are lurking behind the shadows. I'm like, okay. And then I woke up after that. So that was like, it was blunt, just like that. Be careful. They are lurking behind the shadows. They are lurking behind the shadows. So we're going to see what's going on. What's going on with this message, spirit? Lurking behind the shadows. What is this about, spirit? What is this about? All right. Emperor, okay? So y'all can have... Okay, so the will of fortune. So I feel like, okay, lurking behind the shadows give me like stalking energy, <laughs> okay? Uh, Somebody is thinking about doing something unpredictable. Divine say, listen to your intuition about this person. Could have something to do with a Leo, Pisces, Aries, Taurus, Libra. Okay, this person is really in their fucking head. Okay, that you got all this success and shit. Okay, this person is sad. All right, yeah. All right, so this person is lurking behind the shadows. All right, let's get more into it. All right, what else, spirit? So this is an emperor. This could be a father, your grandfather, your grandpa, your dad, your uncle. Okay, this is like somebody like that. Okay. King of Wands, okay? I feel like this person could be some kind of, maybe they like a manager at a job or something like that, okay? Could be. Or this person is watching you. They see that you like, you know, you on your shit, okay? This person could be trying to overcome some challenges, I feel, as well. Yeah, I feel like with the star card, this person is like, This person needs some healing, I feel. This person is going through a lot. Yeah, I feel like with the full card, this person could feel like... This person could be watching you thinking about taking a risk to do something to you, I feel. All right, yeah, because this person role is hard when it comes to trying to keep a home. I feel like this person could be trying to keep a home. This person could be like a... um manager at a job or something like that i feel like this person is like they having a hard time keeping a home i feel all right that's what i feel and this person is watching you like do your motherfucker thing and i feel like this person don't like that shit yo they don't like it i'm gonna take the card on the top exactly three of swords this person is hurt that you having all this i feel all right they heard about this shit. Okay. This person could have did something to hurt you. Okay. They could have like really upset you and betrayed you and different things like that. Okay. This could be a person that you had got a divorce from or something like that. Yeah. This person was very flighty and shit. Always like, you know, <clears throat> excuse me. See, trying to fuck with my throat chakra and shit. I'm going to still get my message out. The fuck. But anyway. Uh, Knight of Wands, this person was very, like, flighty and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, when they used to go out of town and shit, you know what I'm saying, with that chariot, they was out doing one-night stands. They, you know, doing, like, fucked up shit. Yeah, I feel like with the Seven of Cups, this person could be, like, wishing to cause you a painful ending. This person is in their head, want to cause you some kind of painful ending. Yep. They really, really do. They think about this a lot. Y'all look at my damn sage. Y'all know when I start talking about that shit, y'all see what be happening? When I start talking about some shit, that's, listen, my sage start going ham, y'all. This is not good energy. This is not good. This is, this is fucked up. This energy is fucked, yo. Okay. I feel like this person could be going through karma. This is why they thinking about this, okay? Um, this person could be religious. Or this could be somebody that, like I said, you was married to, you got a divorce from, um, something like that. Or this person just could be married, okay? 
this could be just a married person yeah with the hierophant card this could be somebody that you know is religious okay yeah they watching gathering a whole bunch of information you know um this could have been a person you was in a contract with it doesn't have to be um marriage could be this could be like an ex-husband or something like that you know or this could just be a person like maybe you was up under like a small like contract with some kind of way this could be a boss at your job okay this person could be trying to get you fired low-key all right trying to like cook up some shit all right so but basically, I'm feeling like it's an emperor, okay? This is an emperor, okay? Exactly, two of cups, all right? This is a person you came together with to partner with before, all right? Yeah, you could have uh, did something with this person with the seven of pentacles. I feel like this person could be regretting something, a decision that they made, okay, I feel, okay? The person, so this is a situation that I feel like with this energy, this person chose somebody over you that they was like more familiar with. So let's say like, like familiar energy. So like, let's say if, you know what I mean when I say familiar. So this person chose, this wasn't like, it was a new person that they chose. The person that this person chose over you, they was like familiar, you know, like real familiar with the person already. Okay. And I feel like they looking back on this shit. You know what I'm saying? This is a, a like an older man, I feel, with this. This is like an older person, I feel. Okay. But I feel like this person go out of town and shit. They be they do the most out of town. They just they they real flighty and shit, I feel. All right, this person is very arrogant as well. Like, very, very arrogant. Yeah, Queen of Cups. I feel like uh, this person felt like they had a difficult decision to make. All right? Uh, in a situation, like I said. All right? This person could be trying to do something. Somebody is trying to, like, uh, hold back that they trying to, like, set I'm just so tired of this energy of people trying to set people up to get them killed and shit. Like, I'm so tired of this fucking shit. All right? Like, seriously. This person could have really put you through a lot, I feel. All right? Like, really a lot. This person could have had anger issues and shit, I'm feeling. Like, I'm feeling like abuse energy with this. I don't like this. Yeah, Page of Wands. I feel like, um... There could be some information coming through about a death. Okay, and I feel like this person blank is going to blame you. Or this person is trying to come up with ideas to come at you real fast to uh end you. Okay, they trying to be real sneaky with this shit and they trying to like have a lot of people come together with them like teamwork. They really feel like it's going to happen. All right, they feel like it's going to I just don't understand why. Like, this person, or this could be a situation where somebody going to get a message about a death and they're going to be happy about this, this message. I don't know. I'm just feeling that for some reason. Okay, somebody going to be happy about a death they going to hear about. Okay, exactly, four of swords. That came right after the death card. Okay, somebody going to be happy about a death or something like that. Okay, that they going to hear about or something. All right. Five of cups. Or this is going to make somebody mad, I feel. Somebody is going to be mad. But with the page of wands, that's giving me like excitement or something. Well, maybe in a way where, um, no, that's excitement. So this message is going to make somebody happy. I feel. That's what I'm seeing. Okay. Some just fell, y'all. Hold on. Yeah, nine of swords in reverse. This person, listen, they is in their head heavy. So somebody is going to find out about a death. 
Okay, and it's really going to put this person in their head, I feel. All right, but I feel like this death is going to cause somebody to reach out. So let's say like somebody may die with this emperor. Like this could be a baby mama or something like that. And then this person is going to reach out to somebody, I feel. All right. Because I feel like, yeah. Yeah, they're going to reach out. Okay. So, in a whole so far, I'm feeling like three of wands. Yeah, I feel like this person is like going within. So, I feel like this is a situation where, okay, there's an emperor energy that want to do something to somebody. This person is planning or really having wishful thinking about doing something to somebody, I feel. All right. This could be a situation. This could be a situation, y'all, that the emperor is in desperate, like trying to get away from the karmic. That this emperor, this not for everybody. Now, please don't paint, don't do not put this with your situation if you know it don't fit. But what I'm seeing with this particular energy this emperor is feeling so desperate to get out of this situation with this baby mama they at a point where she they willing to set up this baby mama to end this baby mama and this ending is gonna make them happy and then they're gonna charge forward to somebody else yep look at this six of so look at this tower hermit exactly this person going within to try to see how the hell can i move on i, I gotta think about this shit. now i know there's a way out of, out of this right and then boom they go to the tower right there this person gonna have that courage then i feel so this could be a situation where this emperor is so desperate to get out of this situation that it's to a point where they like, okay, I'm going to set this person up my fucking self and end them my fucking self so I can be out. Damn. <laughs> this person wish, wishing about this shit. Yo, they wishing. Damn. So this could be a couple ways. It could be that way or it's, this could be a way where there's an emperor, you know, looking at somebody that's, you know, just wanting to harm them. You know what I'm saying? But this could be a situation where this is a, a emperor and a karmic. And he's like at a point where I want to get the fuck out of this. The only way I can get out of this is if I end this motherfucker, yo. Exactly. Because they already know what's up with this person. So they like, okay, I think I, I'm going to have to do this. Ooh, Ooh, they thinking about it. Y'all, listen, I'm telling you. <laughs> this person thinking about this shit, yo. They thinking about it. That's what I'm feeling, y'all. They thinking about this shit. They like, man, listen. What the fuck do I gotta do, yo? Hold on, y'all. <laughs> Damn. Okay. The shit that I see, y'all. Cause you gotta understand if you have like abilities like a high gift of discernment however you want to say the gift is or whatever but when you can like get into people thoughts yo shit that they not saying on the outside that shit can get deep okay listen this is shit that somebody ain't saying they trying to think of a way they it's like i'm feeling like this person getting desperate like you know what if i gotta end this motherfucker myself that's what the fuck I'm going to do. Like, that's what I'm feeling, yo. That's what I'm feeling, y'all. This is getting woo. Okay, spirit. Hold on. How's this going to end, spirit? How's this going to end? Please give me an ending for this energy. What's the ending? What's the ending? Okay, what's going to come over? Eight of swords. Okay. What's the ending, spirit? What's the ending? What's the ending? This is crazy, y'all. This is crazy. Okay, the ending is somebody gonna move forward. Yep, 
somebody gonna be able to move forward exactly because they gonna win at all costs against this queen of pentacles okay that's what i'm seeing lord have mercy lord have mercy yo somebody and i hear sirens somebody is gonna take out this karmic yo that's what i'm seeing that's what i'm seeing y'all stay at home mom this karmic is fake as fuck listen stop playing with me oh boy lurking through the shadows Wow, male, man, or woman. So this person just could be like stalking somebody, right? Um, that they want to be with, but this person is like, okay, but the only way I'm going to be able to get rid of this karmic is if I take this karmic out myself, yo. Like that's what somebody is like about to do, yo. That's what I'm feeling. Okay, I see... I'm going to just tell you all the signs. I see Aries, Taurus, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. A lot of Taurus. A lot of Aquarius. Libra, Gemini. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. A lot of Scorpio. All right. So, Sagittarius crazy yo that's what this emperor is thinking about doing this emperor thinking about taking somebody out yo left hand somebody could be wow somebody could be slim thick all right we have libra 20s that's what i'm seeing y'all Fast food employee or somebody eating a lot of fast food. This person is a stay-at-home mom because this keep coming out. All right, workaholic. This person may work at home or this could be you. Maybe you a stay-at-home mom and you still work. You work from home. All right, this could be somebody in your energy. Black back tattoos. College graduate. Long straight hair. Real of fate. Damn. This emperor is getting desperate. That's... Wow. Taurus, chest tattoo. This person getting desperate, yo. That's how I'm feeling. Now, this is not for everybody, so please don't try to put this to you and you know this ain't you. Listen to your gut. Your gut will tell you. Actress or actor, real as fuck. I'm telling y'all some real ass shit. Man. <laughs> Cashier. Somebody getting desperate. Like, for real. That's what I'm feeling with the energy. Scary movies. This could be a situation where this is like this karmic. This karmic energy could be real flighty and shit. It could go out of town and, you know, do shit like that. Or maybe it is this emperor. Maybe this emperor just don't care about the marriage no more. And they just out here, like, fucking around and shit. Could be that, too. All right. Rap artist. Tone or muscular. Y'all, this shit crazy, y'all. This is crazy. Yeah, this person want to be single. Or they want to go after somebody that's single. All right? They like, listen, that's the only way I'm going to be able to get rid of this person. Colored hair. Colored eyes. Taurus. That's what I'm seeing, y'all. Tone or muscular. Right leg and or thigh tattoos. Flip-flop lover. Socks with flip-flops, thin eyebrows, multiple ear piercings. All right, smoke cigarettes, somebody could do. All right, flight, TV series, person that take a lot of flights. Okay, this could be a person where they got like accounts together or this could be a person uh, somebody had accounts with. Capricorn, small chest. Alright, somebody could have an accent of some sort. 
somebody could like thongs some kind of way whether they like wearing them or they like with somebody else wearing them all right remember i said manager all right so i'm seeing y'all this is it's crazy gym shoe lover this is something yo beard somebody could have worked in the sex industry workaholic all right they was working the fuck out of that sex industry all right <laughs> sagittarius all right exactly lawyer okay yeah this person is getting desperate like the only way this karma gonna leave me alone is if i take their ass out that's what i'm feeling actor actress that's what i'm seeing y'all this shit crazy for real the shit people be on all right spirit crazy somebody could like fish codfish or maybe this baby mama you know they got a bad hygiene okay this person could have bad hygiene my phone just lit up so yeah okay so the karma got bad hygiene all right damn okay all right so then we have f all right i see rotten like somebody ugh. the hell that's not a that's not something good that you want to find after you see cod fish yo i see rotten so somebody just okay Okay, spirit talking to me. All right. Somebody really don't have good hygiene. That's the second time my phone went off about this. Okay. Uh, I see dots. So divine say connect the dots with the situation. All right. This is a, uh, yeah. All right, spirit. What are the messages? Something with Corey. Dorsey, something with Dorsey. Uh, somebody could drive a Ford. All right. Something with a cord. Maybe this person gonna try to choke this person to death or something. Or a cord, maybe shock them or something like that. I don't know, y'all. This shit crazy. Like, goddamn. Okay, I see Todd. All right. What else, spirit? Where are the messages, spirit? I see doctor. All right. Yeah, this person needs a damn doctor. For real. If, if you smell like codfish and it's like rotten, that's nasty. Like to smell like that. Ew. Like, look, I spit the deck on the devil, yo. This person ain't right. All right, and I feel like somebody is like, I'm telling y'all what I'm seeing. Somebody is desperate. Somebody is really, really getting desperate, y'all. That's what I'm feeling. Like, somebody is really tired of this person. They getting, they like fed up with this motherfucker, yo. Like, for real. Like, I'm feeling that strong. What 
the spirit. Something with the uh, Tory, Tory, Corey. Something with Dom, Dominique. I think I said Tommy already. Tommy. Something with Rudy. All right. This is a, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Well. So this could just be somebody like an ex-husband or somebody that's watching you that's trying to do something to you, really thinking about putting a painful end into you and different things like that. This person could be trying to think of ideas. This could have been a person that you was in partnership with some kind of way. And you know what I'm saying? You may get a message that this person, some kind of message, some kind of way uh, that this person passed away and it may make you happy. Okay, that could be that situation or the situation I said where somebody is really thinking about uh, ending a karmic energy. All right. And they're getting desperate and they thinking about ending this motherfucker. Yo, for real. They are really thinking about taking matters into their own hands with this person. All right. That's what they're thinking about. Okay, so either one of those, you know, just place whatever energy is for you. Okay, something with Rod, Rodney. All right. Something with hot. Yeah, somebody pissed, I feel. Something with hot. Like, this person is, they going through it, yo. All right. So... Capricorn energy too. I don't think I said Capricorn, but all right, you guys, I'm gonna leave it there. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below to see the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace and love.